A royal expert has claimed that Prince Harry, 34, will follow in his 36-year-old brother William's footsteps when it comes to parenting. Speaking in ITV documentary Secrets of the Royal Babies, Meghan and Harry, which aired on Monday night, royal biographer Duncan Larkham, who has previously written biographies on Harry, described William and Kate as hands-on parents. Explaining that both brothers act as role models to each other, he predicted that Harry would look to William for tips on being a father. Larkham also noted that the late Princess Diana was keen to give her sons a normal and private life where possible, an approach Kate and William have continued with George, Charlotte and Louis, and which Meghan and Harry have already taken steps to do with their move to Frogmore Cottage. Speaking about their upbringing, Larkham said, Diana made sure William and Harry lived as much as a normal life as possible and as parents William and Harry will always be influenced by their mother. Her desire to give them a taste of normality runs through the veins of William and Harry. Harry tends to follow in his brother's footsteps and weirdly William tends to follow in Harry's footsteps. They are mentors to each other. So I would expect when Harry becomes a dad he will look at Kate and William's example and follow that almost to the letter. Kate and William have made sure their children aren't followed by paparazzi and are only pictured at official events, with Kate even taking her own pictures of the children to hand out for use. Speaking about Kate and William's hands-on parenting, royal commentator Ingrid Seward added, Prince William famously changed nappies and got up in the night to do feeds school pickup and bath time slash tea time. The speculation is that Harry and Meghan, who does all of the cooking and have a minimal team of staff will too be hands-on parents. Harry and Meghan, who is due to give birth to their first child this month, are expected to leave their official Kensington Palace residence for Frogmore Cottage in the grounds of Windsor Castle as soon as renovation is complete. When finished, the new-look Frogmore Cottage will have views of Windsor Great Park and Frogmore House, where the couple had their wedding reception last year. The Queen gifted Harry and Meghan Frogmore Cottage, which is undergoing major building work to transform it from staff accommodation to a family home. Frogmore Cottage offers a nursery for the baby and ten bedrooms, compared to just two at Nottingham Cottage at Kensington Palace. It also offers acres of private and picturesque grounds for their firstborn to play in without intrusion. In November Kensington Palace said, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex will move to Frogmore Cottage on the Windsor Estate early next year as they prepare for the arrival of their first child. The couple have lived at Nottingham Cottage since their engagement last year. Windsor is a very special place for their royal highnesses and they are grateful that their official residence will be on the estate.